So, let me show you how I changed my boot up logo in my Phoenix Android Mustang car radio. The logo, boot logo, I wanted to put in there instead of whatever they had is that, just to aggravate people <laughs> when they get in my car. And then the other one over here is the one that comes on instead of the orange Mustang or whatever picture you have that stays on, you know, when you have your, <clears throat> uh, when you're playing audio or whatever, that's the background picture. Uh, so let me explain how to do the boot up logo first. Okay, so I'm going to bring up the video I took out in the Mustang. Here it is. I got in the car, turned the key on, of course, and you get a blank screen like you're seeing here. And then you'll see it kick in the um, boot up logo. There it is. See? That's how that works. And you have to hit settings to be able to do that. And I'll show you that in just a moment. Now for the backup or the regular photo that you usually see, it's usually this orange Mustang or whatever kind of backup uh, photo that is in your Android uh, radio. You see the calendar there and the time and all that stuff. Well, watch, I changed that to a picture of myself with an Air Force jet. And then there's the uh, logo or photo that you want to see instead of the orange Mustang. I'll bring that up now. Here's what I changed it to. <clears throat> see, that's the one with the calendar and the time and all that stuff. And I put myself in there with a United States of America jet. <clears throat> and uh, that's easy to do too. Show you how in just a minute. So now... You've taken the pictures in, you have put them into one of these. It's a flash drive. This one is tied into my radio via a USB input. So once you put the flash drive into the USB input, you want to move the top of the screen over to file manager. And when you do that, you will see this screen. The top one says flash. That's the internal Android uh, drive that will store photos, whatever. In this case, I have two, as you can see, two scan disk USB imports. So I push the first one and that shows me what's in the first USB. And that's a list of my songs that I've done on YouTube. But for the photos, my second USB port has them uh, in there. So I'm moving from the songs down to my second USB input. And there you'll see a uh, Tesla boot PNG. Uh, you would also see your renamed um, backup photo to replace that orange Mustang in there. What you do is down below you'll see what looks like paper. You just hit that and that says copy. Then you're going to go back up to flash and anywhere in that section, <coughs> move it all the way up, um, you'll put your logo which you've renamed. Let me zoom in on that if I can. It has to be, that's my boot up one right there. That's already in my flash drive now because I put, I hit paste. Um, and then the zxwlogo.png, that is my backup. See? So that, those are already in there. So then all you want to do at that point is reboot. So you go to user settings save and reboot see it on the bottom just hit that and it'll kick everything in and everything will be cool and wonderful okay so back out in the car with my regular logo going on and my radio playing but i put the sound off so i could do this video with you is you see 
this is how you move stuff. You just scroll it across. You probably already know that if you have a Android for any length of time. But you want to push settings. Once you push settings, that was my uh, logo. But anyway, over here to the left, scroll it up. And way at the bottom, who knew? <laughs> Excuse me. There's a thing called boot logo. Push that button. And then it says here the most suitable size of the image is 768 by 1024, which means 768 pixels wide, 1024 height. Or the image will be adjusted. And then at the bottom there, it says, please select the image. So in my case, I selected this. You just touch it. It'll highlight. And it says... Uh, the most suitable site it says anyway it was installed so that's the quick way of doing the uh, boot up logo Please. who knew like I said okay so what I was going to tell you on rebooting you see where you're in boot logo here just move the screen back here to user settings Push that button there. You see on the bottom now, it says save and reboot. So let's save and reboot just for kicks and giggles. And that's it. It's going to restart. It's going to reboot. And there's my main boot, boot up logo, as you can see. And that'll change. Go to Android and then... It will kick into my uh, guy with the jacket and the U.S. Air Force plane behind it. Won't be long now. You know how these take a little bit. And that's my uh, backup logo or boot up logo in the background. And then the secondary logo right there. And my music is playing. Everything's, everything's cool. So this is me in my little green screen studio, as you can see, looking at my little computer over here. And this is how I do these videos. Uh, I have a YouTube video here, how to set up a green screen room. If you'd like to do that, you can do it for like 250 bucks and change any background that you want. See you later. Watch. All I do in my little green screen room is this. I'll move that up. Bring it down, bring the top down like that, bring the left side over like that, bring the right side over like that, bring the bottom up like that. Then I can move myself anywhere in the background on OBS. Then right click on that, hit filters, put in chroma key, and there. There I am. No green screen. I'll put a little quickie green screen in there and I'll leave you. See, like I put myself in an office. <laughs> Just with a green screen behind me. So it's pretty cool stuff. Go find that video if you'd like to do that.